Hey everybody, it's Bubs, and I'm going to do a review on Clarins Skin Illusion Natural Hydrating Foundation. I have the deepest shade in chocolate. It comes in one fluid ounce, and it's in a glass bottle, and it has a dropper to apply the foundation. I am going to apply the foundation with a brush just because I find that with liquid foundations like this, brushes are better for me, so I'm personally going to use a brush, and I'm going to use swiping down motions and buffing motions to blend it into my skin so off rip i don't like that this is the deepest shade i am not the darkest shade okay okay clarence i am not stop doing that um i don't i do not like that so yeah it already turns me off i really do like the finish of this foundation as you can see my skin looks super glowy. It blends right in. So on their website, it says it's a serum foundation that visibly creates naturally radiant skin for 12 hours of flawless wear. It's available in 22 shades. Still not enough though. It also states that it's the first serum foundation that combines pure plant oils and with the perfect amount of pigments that lets skin breathe. This foundation delivers a smooth, Flawless bare skin feel with buildable coverage in 12 hours of impeccable wear. It says that it has HD light optimizing complex with pink pearls and soft focus powders. This provides immediate radiance. So I do agree that it has a buildable coverage and it does give a natural radiance. I did test this foundation out for more than 12 hours so you will see in the end how it looks. But for the first layer, my skin looks amazing. I have dry, dehydrated skin, and this leaves my skin super glowy and moisturized. And it doesn't feel like I have this foundation on. It's very lightweight. You can see it doesn't match my neck nor my chest, but you know, that's how foundations go. I have three different skin tones. I have a deeper shade on my neck, a lighter shade on my face, and then a in between shade on my chest I don't know I have a ton of different colors and it's really hard to match it so I really would like for them to come out with more deeper and rich shades and more neutral shades this foundation is a little red but I always make things work even though it may not fit me very well so I did decide to add another layer and like I said it is buildable it does build well but to me it's more of a medium coverage I don't think this is a full coverage you can get it to light with just a little product, but it definitely builds to medium coverage. So this is two layers, and as you can see, my skin still looks amazing. It still looks really good. So I'm going to finish my makeup off camera. If you want to see that makeup tutorial, I'm going to leave it in the cards, and I'm going to come back to show you guys the completed look. So this is the completed look. I'm going to be wearing this all day right now. It's about 7 o'clock in the morning. So I'm going to have this past 7 at night. So um, I'm going to be back for a check-in. This is around 3 o'clock and the foundation has started to separate around my smile lines. Just on one side which isn't bad. It hasn't separated on my forehead or on the other side of my mouth so I'm pretty content about that this smile line is very deep pretty much all foundations separate right there but my skin looks amazing it looks really good I'm not oily at all no oil no oil so now this is about eight or nine o'clock i actually fell asleep for an hour so that's why i look like i just woke up because i did i only see oil on my chin which i'm just gonna block quickly with a tissue and it goes right away i did notice that a lot of foundation didn't rub off but it still looks good my face is not oily which is incredible i definitely think this is a long wearing foundation if you like light to medium coverage foundations and you have dry skin I don't think people with oily skin would like this because it's super luminous. So I do agree with the claims that it gives a smooth, flawless, bare skin feel, that it's buildable coverage, still medium, still medium coverage. It lets the skin breathe and 
it hydrates the skin and you could wear this for a long time but anyways give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it let me know what you want to see in future videos subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you in the next one